here in the room and on Zoom on the third twenty no, this is the thirteenth of November, the twenty third of October was the last meeting. And we have um, posted this agenda in three public places and I did see it on the website and emailed to interested parties so I say we can go forward with this with this meeting and um, we were looking for um, Kevin, Kevin Geiger to talk about the first item is he on there yet no, no. not yet so let's um, move ahead with the minutes from the October 23rd meeting which um, look concise and complete to me do you guys have any edits or changes Oh, short nope. and sweet. Nope. Okay. Good. Move to approve those. A second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. Thank you, Julie. Pipe the nose up. <clears throat> and we also had a guest, um, Tom Paquette and Nancy Woolley. Nancy's here. Tom's well, not. Well, Tom has gone off on vacation, so okay. we'll have to reschedule that meeting okay. for another time. All right. And that was about the cemetery request? Yeah. Okay. It is. All right. So we'll. Um, Kick that can down the road a little so we'll bit. So we'll try. We'll try for the twenty seventh. Okay. Okay. Moving along. Okay. Um, you let me know if Kevin shows yep, up. I will. And what Kevin was here to talk about was a discussion of the grant on flood resilient and equitable transportation infrastructure for New Hampshire and Vermont. Just to <laughs> throw that out there, Kevin is the one with the information, but just for um, everyone to think about what that could possibly look like. Um, we also have here a, um, a request about um, adopting a resolution for the Vermont 250th Anniversary Commission, which is um, basically an invitation, and this is coming from this is the, the state and basically they are um, inviting our village or town to join in the commemoration of the American Revolution. A template resolution for participation has been provided for our consideration and please adapt it as necessary for your location. But this resolution is to ensure communication about all the events, activities and comm commemorations taking place throughout Vermont and our New England and New York neighbors as well as provide opportunities for announcing our community commemorative events. They want us to help spread the excitement and build awareness to celebrate, remember, share, learn, and educate as we honor our nation's past 250 years. So, I oh, always might as well sure. I'm for joining that. They're hoping sure. to have all 252 towns in Vermont, mm -hmm. I think. That is to, um, we're also invited to appoint a committee yeah. mm -hmm. that yeah. can plan events in our town. Boy. <laughs> we're here just for more information. <laughs> <laughs> more information. Well, we tried. We're yeah. not sure we want this, this put on the historical society. Well, we could have Martha think about it. All right. But we think there should be more information. <laughs> Um, and the Historical Society isn't under the town's insurance umbrella, um, nor do we have a vast membership. So being the party coordinator probably would not be best served. We could handle the historical piece, mm -hmm. but um, maybe the town celebration could happen on one of our Fourth of July events. Or yeah, I, 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 would think, I would think it would be piggyback, yeah. Yeah, yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah. I would think yeah. so. All right, well, I would See, move to um, Martha has a um, another a question from Martha. You're on mute, Martha. Okay, can you hear me now? All right, thank you. Sorry to bother you. Did you say something about the 4th of July? What year is um, this 250th? Is it next year? I can't remember. I was trying to do the math in my head, but I... 1776, and then, you know... From 25 to 27. From 25 to 27. So we have a, a little um, little time to plan. Several years. Yeah, yeah. They're just okay. getting, the, getting the steam started now. Yeah. And so basically, I was just, oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, and we were thinking that um, a um, 
some kind of event would logically fold in with the Fourth of July celebration. It could kind of amplify the Fourth of July in, in recognition of this larger celebration. Yeah, I think that's a great idea. And I mean, I've been organizing Fourth of July for years. And when in the next couple of years, when we get to that point, we'll, you know, jog my yeah. memory and I'll do my best to yeah, help. Well, I think I'm... it would be great to have a committee. Um, I'm basically the Fourth of July committee by myself. So it would be great to have some helpers. Yeah, we'll work on we'll work on that. But basically adopting okay. this resolution adds us to the list of towns interested in being involved and I'm sure that we will get notifications and reminders and suggestions as the time approaches. So so that said, I would move to uh, adopt this um, Vermont 250th anniversary resolution. I second that. All in favor? Aye. All right. Aye. All right. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Does this has to have to be signed by? I think that's the same thing that we yeah. have. Yeah, yeah. Get yeah, more. Yeah. And, um, Guys, want to do that on camera to make it more powerful. More, make it more. Yeah. So be it. All The uh, next item on the uh, agenda is something that everyone's all excited to be reminded of is that the second installment of taxes are due in a couple days on November 15th by 4 p.m. So anyone that forgot about that can rush on down tomorrow or the next day and, and whip out your wallet. <laughs> and, and we're actively busy trying to figure out how to spend it next year. <laughs> we're in the process. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Tony, have you got anything happening on the library you want to talk about? No, well, we have uh, programs that are always announced, and we certainly like the way the library looks. The painted part looks yeah. good. And painted part we'll, makes the unpainted part look a little worse. It does look a little worse, yeah. but uh, <laughs> that'll happen, I guess. Uh, yeah. Sometime we'll be talking yeah, to you about some other things, but good. We're working on it. Yeah, it was yeah. interesting. I was just in... Um, it was in Salem, Massachusetts, going through a, a historical district there, and I saw a couple buildings that had the same kind of cladding oh, on as yeah. the lower part of the library. It was interesting to see because that seemed like such a unusual. Um, Did it jet out in the building, building <laughs> like this one, or was a it just bit, a different? Yeah. Yeah, a little bit, bit but a little not bit, like not six not inches. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it didn't have that part, but the actual cladding itself is. Yeah, it's interesting. Yeah. But, I think Jeff had some ideas on how we could deal with that, but we'll have to wait. Yeah, anyway. Um, nobody's here to, from Cooter land, but what did, what's, what, what did I miss while I was gone? Not a thing. Nope. We got the signs figured out. We had a couple of calls on. I had a couple of calls at home on the, the closing of Bethel Mountain Road, but... Mm -hmm. They had a sign down on 107 and 100 for Camp Brook being closed. I'm not sure anybody that would turn on there would think it as Camp Brook, but mm -hmm. you know they'd think of it as Bethel Mountain. But um, we got them to move that sign up here on the park Friday, and um, so it just and yep. followed the detour signs. Followed the <laughs> den, and Black Mirror Boulevard is going to get um, shut down at least at night starting at, during, the day. During, the day. during the day right it'll be open at night close during the day yep. yep but that's about it yep. just and for tuesday wednesday and thursday tuesday wednesday week. thursday yeah yep. yep. um, probably going to be a month <laughs> might be a month yeah another month Is yeah martha was that what you when you were just saying it'll probably be a month was that did you mean that's how long you thought bethel mountain road would be closed to traffic because of the work or were you talking about Black, Blackmer again? That's, 
That's what they requested. Blackmer is only going to be closed for like three days during the day. Yeah, that's what I thought from the email I got. So about a month, you think, for, for Beth Mountain? That's what they said originally. Okay. Thank you. <clears throat> yep. Depending on the snow, probably. Yeah. Good things. <clears throat> Terry is not here tonight. Um, is Jeff Gephardt in, no. in the world there? Um, how about, um, Kristen, you got any updates on grants, situations? Nothing worth sharing yet. Nothing worth no. sharing Did yet. Did you get still. in contact with that lady that wants to work with a grant? I haven't, no. Okay. I don't know where we left that. Was I supposed to? If we had budget and finance, we talked about it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Kate Carey? Carly. 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 All right. Then that we're waiting. No, Kevin Geiger. No. Okay, so I guess we'll also um, put that off to the 27th. If we, if we can let them know that that's mm -hmm. another window to come and inform us about that. Um, that's commission. Basically, we've got um, nothing under old business. Any um, public comments out there that people would like to speak about? Zoom looks quiet. Zoom looks quiet. All right, no hands raised. So, nope. well, thank you all for showing. This is uh, maybe a record. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I would move to approve. I mean, move to adjourn. <laughs> I, I approve the adjourn. Right. Thank you all for coming. Yeah. Okay.